Good morning. It is the day before Thanksgiving and I am <laughs> going to try to do a vlog today. Um, cannot promise this vlog thing is just, I don't know. It's not that it's boring, it's just that with COVID still being a thing, my norm for vlogging is being out and about a lot of the time and doing holiday events that are not virtual but majority of them are virtual and Thanksgiving we're not supposed to have people over so yeah it's just kind of like I don't know I wish that it was a little more exciting so I'm doing my best to bring people excitement <laughs> And I didn't even turn the light on in the dining room. So I apologize for those who can see that could not see my face because I didn't realize it was still too dark in there for my camera. So, yes. <laughs> That's my breakfast. Let me bring it over here a little more. It's oatmeal. Apple cinnamon oatmeal. And sorry if you can't see me all that well. I'm in the dining room and I wasn't gonna turn the light on just yet. But yeah, <laughs> it's not bright enough apparently outside yet. And it's gonna be cloudy and so yeah, that's what that is. Hello ladies and germs. It is Kayla and it is the day I've been waiting for. November 27th because Zach is here and we're at the airport and due to COVID I'm not allowed to go in there with mom to go get him so I have to stay out here in the car and stuff like that and he was supposed to come on the 17th but unfortunately some things happened so he had to postpone his flight so now is here and I'm in the airport in the car waiting for him. yeah diamond what are you doing you see the camera <laughs> she turned away because she knew I was videoing her <laughs> you see the camera diamond and now we have Zach in the car, and Hello. this is not how I normally do things with my video, but unfortunately, COVID is a thing, so therefore, we had to do it like this. And I don't know if you guys can see him at the moment, because he's back there. Back there picking his nose! <laughs> That's my mom. <laughs> we brought Diamond to pick up Zach. Yes, we did. As we got construction workers at the house. Yes, we have construction workers at our house. So I hope you don't have to poop, psych. Ah, <laughs> I'm joking. Faster, faster. Faster, faster. Go, go, go. <laughs> Hello! I have a very important guest here. Zach, say hello. Hello. So, I didn't do too much to this vlog apart from speaking in the beginning and then I did a little piece of picking up Zach from the airport. It's not what I normally do because of the simple fact that COVID is still a thing and for those who enjoy when I did vlogmas last year unfortunately that won't be a thing this year I can do it uh, as many videos as I'm able every day the problem is 
with COVID still being a thing, there's really not much to do. There aren't very many Christmas events to go to like there was last year when I did Vlogmas. So, who was that being um, announced? So, Zach, I let's tell these lovely people what your experience was like for seeing the kind of snow that we get here in PA, considering where you live you, in South Carolina, you only get like a dusting of snow once in a great while. Okay. Um, yeah, she's right. Usually we only get like a dusting of snow or whatever, not, not too much. And usually it turns into slush or just turns into ice and it's very dangerous. It turns into patches of black ice, as well as people might know that are from the Carolinas. But um, <clears throat> in more places that are closer to the north, or at least up in North Carolina or the mountains, you might get a bit more snow. But down here, you get a bit more snow. And yesterday, it was so surprising to walk outside and then end up, you know, wearing my schedule just crunch, crunch, crunch. <laughs> Walking around in the snow, it was pretty interesting. The late snow angels and things like that. It was, it was pretty cool though, because for the first time I walked, you know, we walked into the mall while it was snowing and, and of course we were driving of course wow it was it was quite strange indeed plus uh you know the crazy dog that lives in this house she loves snow she loves running around in it and if you ball up a snowball and throw it up in the air she'll jump after it <laughs> man it was, i was so amused it, it was so great it was cool and <clears throat> i must say it was it was definitely an experience talking about well, it was definitely experience going into the snow and walking in it and everything. I mean, yeah, I've seen snow before in the Carolinas, but not exactly like that. It was a little bit more extensive, and of course, yeah, it might have melted a bit, but apparently I guess there's still snow out there because people are scraping it up and whatnot. I heard them shoveling snow earlier. <laughs> so, yeah. All in all, it was pretty cool, and, you know, the hot cocoa that goes with that oh my god the vibes for that oh man it's just so interesting can you tell us where you got that nice hot cocoa from oh uh, from here of course well but where did but did you make it or no your mother made it the first time kayla's mom made hot cocoa the first time mm, so good and then kayla made it for me the second time this morning and she put a little whipped cream in the top. It was good. I didn't notice whipped cream in there, but hey, a it, more cream. Well, it kind of melted in there because of how hot it is. Yeah, but that's pretty cool though. Creamy, creamy, hot chocolate. Yum, yum, yum. So, my beautiful, lovely people, this here ends the vlog for this particular video. <laughs> do, do, do. Hope to see you all soon. I'm going to do my best to keep coming up with great content during these trying times of crazy COVID and uneventful days. So, this morning I went to the gym, did an hour walk, and then just about 10-15 minutes ago, I did six sets of ten squats, but I rested like about... 30 seconds in between each set, that was good. Doing my best to try to keep losing weight and eating a lot healthier with oh, some places possibly closing again due to COVID. That's going to be very difficult, but I'm gonna keep on trying. Hopefully they won't try and shut us down too much. Hopefully, but all I can do is hope and pray mm. that something good happens soon. Yeah. So, feel free to like. <clears throat> share, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you know every time I upload. Stay frosty!